Well, this is your Olympic update on Gold Rush Rio. Uh, First up, a bit of uh, negative news where a bus carrying journalists at the Games was shot at on a highway between Olympic venues. The bus was making its way, in fact, from the Games basketball venue to the main Olympic park when two shots were heard hitting the vehicle. Windows shattered and flying glass left two people with minor injuries. We've heard from some eyewitnesses. But please, I'm not a firearms expert. I, I just, you know, know what a gun sounds like. Um, and I would say... Uh, from my experience that it was a small caliber handgun that was shot at the bus at an angle uh, because the sound was not that of a heavy rifle it was the sound of a small, small arm. We were on the highway going fast and we heard a loud noise and we just got shot at two windows and we could see the bullet. I mean I'm just in shock now but there's there's not much I can say. Transport hub is, as you can see behind me, there are different buses going to different parts of, uh, of the city to different venues, uh, to and from those venues to the Olympic Village, uh, to various different parts. And this incident, from what we understand, took place on that highway that links uh, Deodoro. This is a military controlled zone, uh, the venues in Deodoro. Uh, and the incident took place on a secure highway that cuts through a number of favelas on the way to on the way to the Olympic Park here in Rio. Uh, authorities here have remained rather largely tight-lipped on what happened. From but but from eyewitnesses, what we can tell you is that uh, two uh, small uh, small caliber rounds were fired at the bus, which caused the windows to shatter. Uh, which uh, which uh, obviously caused panic and alarm inside the bus. But from what we understand is that uh, no serious injuries have taken place. Uh, there's only lacerations from uh, picked up from uh, the shattered glass uh, in the in the cabin of the bus. But uh, no other injuries have been reported. We are though to hear further information from the authorities as to wh who they think preliminary is uh, responsible uh, for this. Uh, as I said, this cuts through uh, a large favela in the city of Rio de Janeiro. Uh, and the lead up to the Rio Olympics, there was a lot of questions being asked about how they would sort of secure these places, which are riddled with crime, with the, which are riddled with gun violence on a, on a literally a daily basis.